Hey everyone, this is Satvik and I'm back again with a new video and in this video we'll discuss about Twitter OSINT so without getting any delay let's dive into the video so guys uh, if you had uh, if you had been following my channel you would be knowing uh, knowing that I'm continuing a series on OSINT and uh, recently I had uh, completed the image OSINT part and now we'll discuss about the social media OSINTs that uh, we can perform and in this video we'll particularly uh, target on Twitter so if you don't know twitter twitter is a one of the top uh, social media platform available uh, on the earth right now and you can see most of the celebrities and most of the uh, people will use twitter for official announcements and stuff so as i told you we'll discuss about how you can do osint on a uh, twitter uh, of a particular person right we always look into uh, tweets of some person in twitter let me show you uh, this thing so this is my twitter if you if you're not following me uh, do check out the link is in the description below where i share some uh, cyber security related stuff so in twitter everything is called as tweets so the every data suppose if you take a uh, tiberis or somdev so these are nothing but tweets right so what uh, the people share their information or people uh, convey their uh, feelings or anything in the form of tweets so that's the reason why uh, it is called as twitter so in this video as i told you we will see how you can enumerate various stuff and how you can do osint on any person so there is a uh, for this guys before starting you need to have a linux distribution any linux distribution is fine whether it is ubuntu parrot os or anything else anything is absolutely fine you can host it on cloud or anything else and uh, coming to the tool so this is the tool that we are going to use uh, so this is a popular framework and this is not a new video or this is not a one of the newest video there are many videos out there on this project and i do want to cover this thing on my channel so if you can see this is a tool name called as twint so uh, i know this i known this tool as since there is a, a module in python called as twint so i worked on a tool out there on twitter osint but recently i got to know about this uh, framework right uh, if you can see this is a, such a cool framework that you can install on uh, any machine mostly linux as i told you and you can uh, do various kinds of stuff so if you can see uh, these are all the commands that you can run so if you type twint after installing u and username so it will scrape all the tweets so scraping or anything like that, it it tries to get all the tweets of a person suppose if you uh, try to get them uh, my username so my username is nullshock1 so here the username is nothing but the id right and you can do some uh, parameters like you can search whether there is something called pineapple like uh, there are some like if, suppose if I, if I had tweeted anything regarding pineapple so it will scrape all the tweets and you can see various stuffs like followers following and so there are some issues with this tool i'll let you know and as i told you i had worked on uh, this particular module you can see uh, you can import you can, if you are a good python developer or if you are interested you can uh, simply import this particular uh, pip module and you can start working you can build your own tools uh, for a specified task so i had built my own tool uh, regarding this twint module so i'll cover that in the next video but as of now we'll see uh, what this tool do uh, what this tool does and how we can use it to enumerate the stuff right so let me copy this url and let me go to my uh, distribution which is kali linux so i'm using kali linux in this case so let me enlarge it and let me zoom in a little bit so i'm going to a directory tools so this is where i put all my tools uh, like all these tools or thing like that so i'm going to clone this thing particular uh, github repository so I'll, if you i'll provide you the link for this in the description below right you can do check that out from there and uh, i'll go to this twin uh, folder let's see what we got over here so you can see something like automate.py you can automate the stuff but we'll go in a basic way so if you can see there is something called as setup.py right so first of all uh, we need to run this thing so before running we need to provide the executable rights for this uh, file so if you look into ls-la you can see this particular uh, file doesn't have executable rights so we'll give the executable rights chmod plus x and setup.py now if you do the ls hyphen la once again and you can see it is having the executable rights right so we'll run that so 
it is really simple dot slash setup dot pi and install simply hit enter and it is going to install uh, this particular twint application into your uh, kali machine with the help of all the repositories and stuff and if you want to work with python so i'll cover a detailed video on that guys no need to worry so you can uh, pip3 install this particular thing twint and you can import in your python programs and you can use that right so we are done guys we are done with the installation step if you followed this you can see it uh, got some various packages and stuff so you don't need to go to any directory you can go you can from anywhere you can simply type twint hyphen hyphen help to view all the manual of this tool so it is going to take a little bit of time since we only install it for now and it is going to get uh, things and you can see there are some a huge variety of uh, options over here like you can specify the proxy host you can specify all the tweets like there are many things there are many things this tool consists of and we'll cover few of them and uh, as always you can uh, look or anything of them you can also get the geolocation you can do various stuff you can right so we'll start with the basic thing so twint so we can also look into this thing like uh, hyphen u for the username as for search and things like that twint hyphen u and uh, let me get my tweets and there's also an issue i'll tell you regarding that so there will be a weird issue that might you might be getting uh, you can see i'm getting all the tweets uh, that i had uh, done till now you can with the timestamp it's a timestamp as well uh, i think i have like uh, let me see how many tweets i have i have like 582 tweets and i think it got all of them almost all of them i think so with emojis uh, with emojis right so this is a uh, Cool utility you can see this is the basic thing and also you can search for any suppose let me think there is something like i mentioned uh, any particular string like uh, subscribe okay so in my tweets i suppose if i had in if any of my tweet consists of a word subscribe then it is going to scrape all those and you can see uh, learn bug bounty using uh, hack this site uh, please subscribe to my youtube channel for more up, uh, and yeah you can see it is the basic thing like it all it scraped all my tweets which are consisting uh subscribe a subscribe keyword in them and you can see many more things and one cool thing one more cool thing is you can uh, save all these things you can see this output file like if you want to gather all the files and if you want to analyze it for the future you can do that any file format you can see and one more cool thing we'll try this thing out and let's see what it does yes and the hyphen hyphen email hyphen hyphen phone so what it is going to do is it is going to search first of all let me look for email so it is going to search whether there is any email or email keyword present in any of the tweets that this person uh, which is me in my case is having let me hit enter let's wait for a while and let's see you can see uh so it is also scraping something like email sending bot using python so these are some projects that i had built uh, in the past right you can see uh wo session app is completely private and doesn't even ask you for a mobile or email just give it a try that's cool right and also one more thing is uh you can see uh there is i'm leaving twitter for few days like i took a break a, a break then at the past and you can see this is by scraping you can you found out my mail right uh you can see email verification so wherever there is a, a keyboard email then it is scraping all those things right so no more data scraping will stop now found zero tweets in this search right cool it is uh, i think there is a mistake over this but still we got some good uh, data over here and we can also include something like a phone so if there is any phone keyword uh, it will try to scrape that thing out let's see whether we got anything guys never miss any opportunity mail okay and uh, it might be helpful for attack i think i haven't mentioned anywhere a phone or anything like that but uh, yes it tried to do a little bit of enumeration or osint over here and it tried to give us some good amount of information that see we can't always uh, go to the twitter uh, page and you can't always scroll over his uh, account right so this is a problem with that and one more cool thing with this particular uh, twint tool is 
if you want to uh, do some osint on instagram there is something a tool called as osint gram and for that you need to provide some an account details but here you don't need to provide anything anything literally don't need to provide literally anything just install the tool and you are done right you can do sometimes uh, there could be some errors like uh, uh, too many issues or anything like that sometimes if there are too many requests coming out from this tool then it is definitely going you to throw an error so uh, put the tool in the hold and just uh, go to the next uh, let's leave it for a while and then then go and you can see uh, you can also provide the timestamps over here on this particular date right and yes this is the basic thing you can see since and you can see uh, the tweets that were tweeted since from that particular uh, time to now it will collect all these tweets and you can see the what are the user retweets user following and followers so i'll tell you when this uh, tool get uh, problematic sorry let me close this thing up yep hyphen hyphen followers it will uh, it will provide me all the followers that i am following all my followers sorry so sometimes it doesn't work there the, yes you can see something like critical a uh, root twint feed follow index error so this is due to many requests coming out there or since i'm following like huge number like 100 members so it is going to uh, lag or it will going to throw me an error so if you can search for this error on the google it will they'll definitely show you that there is a solution uh, there is a, a page over there github so if you go over there and in the issues tab you can see uh, there has been a mention for that so sometimes it's like any tool doesn't work all the time sometimes it uh, get problematic but still this is a great tool to start with on twitter osint and uh, yep in the next videos we'll also discuss about way uh osint tech osint uh, tricks and things on various social media so and if you are if you are uh, curious about how to prevent these kinds of stuff so put your account on private and then you are done so since the twin is having a twitter account right and it is trying to fetch the public so my account is a public account so anyone can fetch or view the tweets but if i make my account to the private account only authorized one can do that so if i uh, lock my account then this twin is not going to work so that is it guys for today i hope you really like this video and if you really like this video do share with your friends who are uh, really interested and you can also provide your suggestions and feedback in the link that is in the google form the link provided in the description below and really thank you guys for watching this video and uh, i'll meet you in the next video thank you